What's up, YouTube? I have um, a video for you guys today. It's just me talking. Uh, just pretty much what's going on. You know, I know you guys saw the video of me playing, uh, not playing, but uh, at rugby tryouts in uh, Glendale, Colorado, for the uh, Raptors, Colorado Raptors, um, which is which is pretty exciting. Something I've you know never done. I'm totally new to the sport completely. Um, and today's video is just it's, it's pretty emotional day for me. Um, I have not been able to play in a organized sport for 11 years. Um, 2010 was the last time I played um, competitive sports and uh, it's been tough, you know, it's been tough mentally to continually um, not give up on myself and just call it quits. Um, you know, I was in high school pretty much, you know, senior year of high school um, when the last time that I played competitively in a sport. and. I am 28 years old right now, um, you know, still looking for something, you know, for me, pretty much a, a, a reason, you know, it's hard being an athlete and not having, um, you know, reason as, as much as, as such in like some type of sport. And uh, I've been chasing for it for a very long time now, despite, you know, my failures in um, the NFL. Um, you know, I've taken on this other opportunity that was presented to me actually from one of the players, um, Malik. So shout out to you, Malik. Um, you're, you know, the reason why I got, you know, this opportunity with the team. Um, it was said that he mentioned me to the uh, the manager of the team and, um, you know, they looked me up and, and they gave me this opportunity. And, um, you know, I just want to say, you know, first off, you know, whatever happens, um, you know, I'm, I'm thankful for the opportunity, period. Um, I've been watching so much rugby ever since I was notified on this uh, situation and this opportunity. And um, honestly, I'm very entertained by, a, I'm not even gonna bullshit a little bit more than um, football because it's just a continual continual uh, game, continual movement, and you know, I got ADD, so it's like, I have to always be doing something, you know, when I'm gaming, when I'm like, I'm smoking, you know, I've created bad habits a little bit from ADD. And uh, I feel like it would help me with that, just being constantly on the move. Um, and, you know, I see great things that could come out of being a rugby player. Um, you know, it's once again, like I know, I have to learn the basics, the fundamentals of the game. It's not football. I understand that. It's a lot more conditioning, you know, a little bit more nicks and aches. Um, and, um, you know, it's it's a, it's a different ball game. It's not the same type of ball game. You know, there are mechanics that I'm already gifted with as far as just um, explosive abilities, running, um, cutting, you know, running back skills pretty much, um, which they said, you know, if they decided to sign me, um, I would be a back, which is I think like a, an 11 or 10 through 15. Um, people are saying that I, they want me at like 11. Um, so I'm not sure what specifically that like 100% means. Like I, I know what it means, but I don't know the exact positions, you know, just like main goals, you know, am I like, you know, mainly just, just a runner. Um, Cause at that position I see, they do a lot of passing and running at the same time, just kind of getting forward ground and then breaking down and or passing um but um i got my contract so yeah um they do want to sign me to the team and um i just signed the contract today so um i will be we will be moving to denver colorado um i'm just thankful for everybody um, that's been here ever since, you know, waiting for an opportunity for me. I've been getting so many messages from people international. I've been getting a whole lot of international messages from everybody, uh, from New Zealand, South Africa, Ireland, um, Australia, you know, just saying, you know, I'm, I'm going to really do good and um, rugby ain't going to kill it. So I'm hoping so. I don't want to let anybody down. Uh, this is something that I'm definitely going to be just trying to do as much as I can. And I want, I mean, you know, if it could it lead to a possibility to possibly, you know, get into the NFL, maybe, you know, maybe the Denver Broncos see me and they want to give me a tryout. Cool. You know, I mean, would I take the opportunity? Yeah. I mean, I don't know. I might just fall in love with rugby so much that I just, that's all I want to do now. You know, I don't even desire football anymore. Or I might just want to get a few years in football in and come back to rugby. Never, never know what could happen. You know, it could lead me to that possibility. I know that there are rugby players that have um, transitioned in the NFL and then went back to uh, rugby. 
and um, you know maybe that might be my route um, but either way I'm pretty excited um, for this transition for myself um, you know because I know I'm gonna get in hella good shape first off being in my high city <laughs> Denver uh, with that that thin air up there and on top of that all the conditioning rugby requires um, so they're definitely gonna get me in shape you know I already have the strength and um, just athleticism now it's just fun fundamentals um, and you know breaking down the skill um, to be a better athlete so hopefully I can really excel this year um, our first game is February 28th 28th babe 27th babe what did they say the first game was like the 27th uh, yeah, February 27th um, is actually the first game. So um, I am scheduled to be, it is the 27th right now. I am scheduled to be in town February 8th, um, trying to make a miracle happen right now so we can move this whole house <laughs> um, by then, or at least I'll be out there and she'll be here. I uh, really don't want to have to pay rent here and there at the same time. But uh, I'm going to do what I need to do. Um, and I, I will be able to film this journey. Um, I've got the, um, I, I've been allowed by the coaches and the, the staff and all to continue my YouTube channel to be able to film the process, kind of like a doc, documentary or whatever, or in training and, um, you know, get a video guy and out there and uh, pretty much help me with this process and help bring more notice in America of, of rugby. You know, I think for for such a, you know, a sport, I feel like it should be a lot bigger than what it is, at least in America, you know, because I, I see that it's big everywhere else but America because America kind of likes to take something, make it their own, and blow it up. And that's what football is, if you guys didn't know. Um, so, um, yeah, you know, I hopefully, and I haven't seen any other, like, rugby YouTubers so I think that'll be beneficial for me as well and um, help grow my channel and help get more notice into the sport and get more people, you know, excited about it or into it. So that's going to be a goal for me and, you know, also um, developing my skills. Um, but that being said, next month, everything, everything changes. So, uh, yeah, let's, let's get it done. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel. Turn on post notifications because I know you guys are, you guys are going to, you, you know, you're not going to want to miss what's going on with this channel for the future. So appreciate you guys. Comment below what team you would like to see me on in the future. And uh, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.